As you know, many of our paternity stories have three sides to them. They're, you know, it's what she said, it's what he said, and it's what the DNA truth says, right? Well, this is Chantel. Welcome Chantel to the Mari Show, everybody. Chantel has come here determined to prove to a man named Chuck that he is the father of her son, Joseph. Now, Chuck's memory of their relationship is... How cute to see. Chuck's memory of the relationship is simple. There wasn't one, period. Chantel swears there was a lot more to it. Watch. I'm tired of this he say, she say business. Joseph is Chuck's son, and I'm here to tell you the facts. Chuck said we had a one night stand. The truth is we was dating for a month. Chuck claimed he has some kind of medical issue. He said he can't make babies. Guess what? Today is his lucky day. I am fed up with him choosing women and alcohol over our son. After today, Chuck will be doing his part. So, how long were you and him in a relationship? Maury, we've been together for two months till I got pregnant. That's lying. right. I called you him so and lying. told him I was pregnant. He said he could not have a baby. He told my producers that. When he was young, he used to go on bicycles and do all these wheelies. And because of that... <laughs> Maury, yeah. that's a lie. And because yeah. of that, he went to the doctor, and the doctor said he has a low sperm count because his testicles were all messed up. <laughs> Well, I'm not pregnant. Yeah. He said he don't want no use, no protection, because he Lies. want a child. Oh. Lies. That is so maybe he didn't, maybe, 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 maybe he didn't want lying. protection because he didn't think he could make babies. Maury, he can have that baby. You are so confident that he is the father of your child. Maury, I said I'm so confident I would do a split. <laughs> You see, here's the thing. You think he's immature, but he's 11 years older than you. Yes, Maury, he is 11 years older than me. But I expect him to be a man and step up and be a father. Uh, be a man about what? Then, be my baby. There's another thing you all disagree about. You all planned a baby shower. You said you planned a baby shower, what you called an all-white baby shower. Everybody's yes. going to wear white. Yes, Maury. He, he was going to come in white. His family was going to come in white. You were going to yes. come in white. Your family was coming in white. Yes. Yes. My family even we knew you were to him. Right. My family came, and his family didn't show. He didn't show up. <laughs> and neither did he. No. You think he's just an habitual liar. Yes, Maury. But Stop there's somebody... There's somebody you in, just in your life who is taking his place as a father to Joseph. Yes, my boyfriend, Robert. Robert. He's been there from the hospital taking oh. care of the baby. Oh. The in fact... Oh. Oh. always taking care of his... doing his job right. where he should be doing. <laughs> He should be going. Stop lying. You think this child looks like him? The baby looks like him. Well, let's take a look. You think he looks like yes. him? Yes. Look at this, Mari. Look at this. By the way, didn't he come to the hospital after Joseph was born? Yes, Maury. He Did didn't come to... He said he would not want to get attached to the baby till we get a DNA test. I, I never said that. I never said that. Stop putting words in my mouth. I never said that. All right. Well, everybody, here's Chuck. Welcome Chuck to the show. Boy, there's a completely different story that you tell than what she tells. Man, she's a habitual liar, Maury. Like, a habitual liar. Hey, my mind, my mind is like a whole kid, like that baby right there, Maury. 
Yeah. Th that's not my bed. I don't look nothing like me. Oh, nothing like me. I don't see no he got in that bed that look like, like me, Maury. Not at all. How many kids do you have? I have none. I have none. Because he you don't, don't want today. Because you don't think you can make them, right? I can't have kids, Maury. Right. I roll bikes. And I used to be a pop willy artist, so you know I like the pop willies. So one day I'm riding my bike, I'm popping a willy. Boo. And so happened, you know, I fell, I hit my sack. No. So the doctor told me no. that I can't have kids no. until I get the operation done. What was your reaction when she told you she was pregnant? I didn't care. I didn't give her no reaction. But I didn't care. I didn't care. It didn't even matter to me. And that baby doesn't look like you. That baby ain't mine. What about her boyfriend Robert? What do you think about that? Man, listen. That dude is crazy, too. <laughs> he need help. Crazy? Yeah, he need help. Crazy. He need help, crazy too. Crazy is what you think on, you having sex with this it's woman funny how, too much. It's funny how you got wife and she was pregnant, so you been telling y'all wasn't doing nothing then? Oh. Hell no. 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 By chance, if this is your miracle child, will you get in this child's I'm life? I'm going to myself and be a man about my Maury. OK. I am. Right. Here we go. When it comes to three-month-old Joseph, Chuck, you are not... Oh! 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 It's okay. It's all right. All right? First of all, you've got a good man who's in this child's life, okay? If you want us to help you test somebody else, we'll be glad to. All right? Okay? But you've got Robert. That's all you care about. He wasn't in this child's life anyway, was he? Okay. You okay? You all right? Okay. Now that you got it's your all answer, good. It's all good. now go ahead and find your it's real baby good. dad and leave me that alone. Chuck. You got what you wanted. You want to say anything to him? You don't. You don't want to say anything. No. Chuck, I don't want you to hold it against her. Okay. All right. Cool. I'm cool. You go I'm ahead fine. and li live your life. Yes, sir. Okay. I sure will. Thank you. Thank you. You are not the father. <laughs>